morning guys welcome back to today's video today is friday i can't believe it's friday but not only is it friday but it's spring it's spring outside if you can't tell because all the snow is melting you may be able to tell because of the mud and then we have a little bit of water going down into our big field there horses are smart and they're far in the back you know she just did that thing where uh, how dogs do where they like kick out behind them after they go to the bathroom or they get like and, and then they growl as a way to be like, I'm the boss of this place. <laughs> she thinks she's the boss of this place. Anyway, today we're headed out for a walk. Sophie wants to go for a walk today and it is beautiful weather and we need to get walking. Every spring, I always have like asthma whenever I exercise after I haven't exercised for like the whole winter. So yeah, the sooner I get back at it, the better. Debbie's at the dentist, so I told Sophie, pick a, pick a pet any pet and we'll take them for a walk. So I picked Ellie and you guys will not believe who she picked. Tell them the true story. The true story is that I was begging her all day to go on a walk. Oh no, but I have like so much stuff to do. I have Hi. responsibilities, you know. Is she good for walking with you? Uh, yeah, she'll be good, but are you gonna take off your horse's blanket and brush yeah, her, give her a I'm quick brush? Oh, okay, here. move. I picked Willow instead of Honey because Willow loves walks. Willow loves walks and Sophie loves Willow. <laughs> Oh, stop See? This is what I mean. Look how good Willow stands. I know. Willow's like, what is that furry little thing? I've never seen it before, and I don't like it. And now she's tangled up around my ankles. What? Yeah, when we get back, we'll take off their blankets. Willow's laid down all three times this warm day. Hey, Ellie. Ellie. Oh, I'm going to get shocked. Ellie. She really wants to play. Ellie loves our dog so much, and if any dog or any person says, oh. I don't like you, or they resist her, she will bark at them and, and, and jump on them and do whatever she can to get them to love her. Help. I love that in her. Pet her. No, is she, no. Is she shocky? I don't know, but I got shocked by the blanket. But I have a plan now. I was talking to one of my friends today, and she told me what they do okay. at their barn when they bring dogs. So I'm going to incorporate a couple of her okay. suggestions oh, girl. I'm still <laughs> and see now if I'm it can work. Again. All right, hurry up, get ready. You're like begging me. Let's go, let's go. I know, but I had to take her blanket off and it was scary. All right, this is ridiculous. My dog just ran through a big puddle, almost as big as her. She knows nothing about the electric fence. Come on. Be honest, I've never liked spring. <laughs> spring has never been my season. And all my kids have been born in like October, November, December, and January. All of them, except for Gabby. Gabby's a spring baby. Come on! Come here! Come on! Come on! I can't run in these Come on! Ellie. Ellie's like, please be my friend. She's not good at making friends. Willow's <laughs> like, what is that? Please don't spook. <laughs> Let them meet, at least so that they can meet. Oh, you little liar. Let her meet. I can't run in these pants. You can only have to walk. Come on, Penny! Come here! So take a chance Penny! Come on! Come on! Uh-oh. Chino's blowing a blanket. Oh, that's Chino's girlfriend. What's wrong with you? Ellie's like, let's go! <laughs> My friend is going! <laughs> yeah, Ellie, she's not your friend. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Ellie, we'll be back to take your blankets off, girly. <laughs> Ellie, settle. Oh my god, my dog is crazy. Come on. Come on, let's walk. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> what the heck, Sophie? <laughs> Ellie. <laughs> Alright, I want a refund. No offense, Ellie, but she's crazy. So a car just went by and actually like did exactly what they're supposed to do. Slow down, 
Oh my God. All right, so this is embarrassing. I have Ellie barking at Willow, trying to get to her. I have Gracie throwing a fit and screaming in the background because, <laughs> no, Ellie, no. Gracie screaming in the background. And then I have Chino screaming in the background. It's like all our neighbors know that we're up to something, all the noise we're making. So actually, it's good that I brought Ellie so I can teach her. Oh, they're home now. Oh, Gabby and Sam are home. But it's good that I brought her. She already started walking. I already started teaching her not to bark. She doesn't do a lot of barking at home, so. This is why Willow's good. Oh, they're bolting. Now Chino and Penny are bolting across the field in the mud. Let's go for a nice relaxing walk, she says. Let's just go out and get some exercise, she says. All right, we have to cross over to the other side now. Girl, good girl, yeah, good girl. She looks really cute today. Uh, Ellie, 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 Ellie. Of course, coming. Ellie, Ellie, sit, sit. No, sit, there. Hey, Ellie, <laughs> she's not your friend. Ellie, turn around here, look. See how much older she looks with her hair up? With her ears up? With her ears up, but with her hair up? All right. Stay there. Ellie, Ellie, Ellie. Hey. Be good. Hey. Oh my God. Right? Yeah. Ellie. Good girl. All right. I'm going to put you guys away so that I can literally enjoy oh, our walk she wants to trot and train my dog because I don't want a crazy dog. I want a nice little girl that listens she wants to drop and understands what she's actually look, getting it look now. Look how excited she is. I know, they are all, like, where are we going? they're oh, all excited to get out. Look, she's actually getting it now though. That's why I brought Willow. I taught her dog to walk on a leash. Yeah, like she's loving it. Now that she's taking her focus off the, the horse. <laughs> yes, I know. She's like, I want to go too. <laughs> She's loving her walk. Willow was so excited she didn't want to stop. things have calmed down just joking <laughs> whoa Ellie wait let me see your collar here just joking things have not calmed down <laughs> Willow is so excited to get out she doesn't want to walk, she doesn't want to walk. <laughs> and neither does Ellie thank God she's small or I'd be dragged I feel like never before in my life have I said the words, don't drink from that pedal. Are those the words that you said? I've been saying them a hundred times. Have you not heard me? Have you heard me saying, Willa, walk, Willa, walk. No, yeah. Saying it in my brain. <laughs> Willa wants to run. Like, she's so excited. But she's calm. She's like, you have treats for me. Yeah, she thinks I have treats. Or else she's trying to get in front of my little... Or else she's trying to get in behind Ellie. But Ellie, I've got her to stop barking. <laughs> she wants to be friends. She's like, you're my friend. The big differences between Yorkies and Chihuahuas is that one, my Chihuahuas would have been in my arms already so long ago because there's little tiny rocks on this road and they don't do that. And they don't run. <laughs> and yeah, here's Ellie. We've been going a while and she's not even trying to get up yet. You only get so many Ellie! <laughs> <laughs> Willow runs my speed. <laughs> Ellie's fast. Surround the sun. You can tell we're going back now. Everybody's tired. Willow's not going Willow. slow. Willow wants to can her around again. <laughs> And try. We only try. She wants to Look, her ears have been forward this whole yeah, walk. Yeah, her her ears have been forward this whole walk. She's so excited. She looks like 
We got the best little welcoming crew. Sophie found a dead animal. She thinks it's a hawk. Oh my gosh, is it a chicken? <gasps> Somebody's chicken. Somebody's red sex link chicken. That's why we don't free. That's why we don't let our horses run free range. Or that's why we don't let our chickens run free range. I want them to run free range. I want them to love that. And in the future, we'll build something that will be like better for them. Disgusting because I see its neck bone and it has no head. We eat the neck bones of turkeys. Not chickens. Not our chickens. Anyway, we don't have any red sex leak chickens, so um, it's not ours. <laughs> I'm not fit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> We're not fit. My back hurts from that walk, but the rest of me feels good, and my asthma was really good. Did you know chickens can live without a head? Yeah, well, not really. They can have a reflex. They can have a reflex and run around without a head, but then eventually that stops. Okay, we're going to try Ellie with the puppy. Ellie, <laughs> you be gentle. Ellie with the puppy. Ellie with the pony. See, everybody's already scared of the puppy. Come here, I mean, come here, Alex. Hi, honey baby. Here, Gracie. Come on, we're gonna take your blanket off so you can roll. <laughs> Penny looks like her feet are so black right now from running through the field chasing us. Come here. Here, I'll hold this. The aliens are here, come on. The TikTok aliens, we gotta go. Get in the car, quick. Come on, we can outrun them. Come on. Tell Gabby to come out then, at least we'll save her. Okay. Gabby, outside, please. Quick, quick. <laughs> oh my God. Sam believes everything that he sees on TikTok and there's this big thing that aliens were supposed to show up yesterday and so Sophie wanted to prank them. But yeah, we're too lazy to go up to the car and prank them. House. We don't live in a car. I know, but we were gonna go get in the car and tell them to come out. Yeah. But actually call Gabby and tell her to take Chino's blanket off. Okay, so the other day when I was learning to make dog toys, I was looking at other crafts I could make with fleece and I found this snuffle ball. So basically the dog has to snuffle out the treats. I used dog food instead of treats and I think you could use it, oh see? <laughs> I think you could use this for for like a slow feeder for dogs like like Ellie that gorge themselves. Then my friend sent me a message today and said you should make a snuffle mat. And they do have snuffle mats too and I did see them. Um, I think Sophie and I might try and make one and use it as a feeder. This in particular I made to keep Ellie busy when we are in the barn so that she can learn to be happy in the barn and be around the horses without being um, under the horse's feet all the time. So anyway, I'm gonna show Ellie and see if she can figure it out. Look, Ellie. Look, look, you see it? She smells it. Clearly she knows that there are treats in there. Her, the idea is that she has to grab one of those things and pull it out and then the treats are wrapped up in the fleece. And it's too hard for her. <laughs> She's like, this is too hard. <laughs> oh, she got one. Did she get one? Oh, she got it. So then after she gets it out, Ellie, after she gets it out, she's supposed to unravel it. Unravel it. Look, look, look. There's treat. There's food in there. Look, look. All right. So clearly it doesn't work for her yet. Let's see. Daisy, look. Here, Molly, you take a turn. Get it. Go ahead. Get it. So Molly's good at pulling them out. They just don't understand that they have to unravel them. I think lip mats are better. Oh, Daisy got it. Daisy got it. Ellie. Daisy, Ellie. Ellie got it. Ellie got it. Look, she figured it out. <laughs> She's like, wow. Look, there's more here. Look, there's more over there. Get those gray ones that, that Molly pulled out. 
Get it, Molly. Get it. Oh, she got one. Get it, Molly. Get it. I definitely think uh, Snuffle Mat might be easier because it's pre-made and all you have to do is add the food to it or add the treats. Sophie ruined my video by bringing out her lick mat. <laughs> well, I'm picking the pieces out of it. Go ahead. Y'all nice. I love seeing our three dogs all in a row like that. Four dogs. So every Friday we do spelling tests. This is Gabby's spelling test. You can't okay, see the words can... because they're tiny. They're really, really hard words. They're 10th grade spelling words. They're ridiculously hard. I don't even know how to, I don't even know what any of these words are, let alone how to pronounce them. Anyway, at the end of her spelling test every Friday, we're going to start doing tests for her license. I want to say forever, we could be good together. Guess mystery loves company. Better to late than never. You know we could do better. So take a chance and run with me. Don't you know that you're beautiful?